Welcome, get this out of the way. Welcome back to another, welcome back to another London, fucking hell, come on dickhead. Welcome back to another London postcode challenge video. This time we're heading off to the following postcode. This was chosen by my good friend and bandmate, uh, Andrew the Koala. Uh, he was in a band called The Jazz June back in the 90s. We played in bands together, played in America, Finland, all over the place. So he chose uh, N16, Stoke Newington, um, Dalston, because he used to live there. And uh, when he first kind of moved to London and we were hanging out a lot, uh, that's where he used to live. So I'm going to go meet up with him. Uh, he's bringing his two kids down, and we're gonna go skate around. Let's get to it. Boom. So this behind me is Gillette Square, where they've had a couple of skate events. I don't think people skate as much as they used to, but um, well, I'd start off here. Uh, so, for anyone who skates North London a lot, will we'll know this place. So, what was the trick you wanted me to do? Uh, uh, backside tail. <laughs> I must have missed. You came in. <laughs> okay. Just, just go off piece, dude. Man, why don't you do a backside tail slot style? <laughs> <laughs> That's perfect. No credit. No credit. Common Road, which is where uh, Mark failed at the time, later to be Mark Bolan, uh, grew up. It's the house he grew up in. It's a little bit of a length because the last episode uh, we went to where he's been laid to rest. Over there, that's a, uh, a Banksy of the royal family. As you can see, apparently the uh, council thought it was just some random graffiti and started trying to paint over it but then someone informed them to stop so and now the Banksy still lives so the last skate of this ledge behind me with the homie Jay Jay Bessens uh, very long time ago but uh, I think I'm gonna use this ledge for the half cab nose let's get it done sun in my eye Hey, what can you tell me about John Campbell Road? Well, it was a street I lived on for about um, seven years. There was a couple incidents here. One, I got every single piece of my bike stolen, upset the frame off that tree there. Nice. <laughs> I had our car got broken into and they stole, uh, our, this is a blast in the past, the Tom Tom. <laughs> and one night we were sitting in bed at like four in the morning and I heard like a and I was like oh that can't be someone in my house and I heard another foot step I was like it's definitely something in my house and I had this thing in my mind where I was like do I lay here and let them steal everything or do I try to defend myself and then I was like I'm just gonna let them steal everything because it could be crazy but then I was like no I can't do it <laughs> so I jumped up and I grabbed the door did you get old jersey on them and I was like 
go to Columbus. And they, they like, I heard them go, do, 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 do. But then when I came down, I saw they had just kicked this door in. Crazy. And then walked all the way up to the third floor and uh, walked into our flat. So, But then they got caught because they went down the street, did the same exact thing to someone else's flat, and they found um, matching snicker <laughs> tracks <laughs> on both doors. <laughs> What about the the song? So hospital is just about all the crazy stuff that happened out here and like anytime you walk out here you never know what's gonna happen whether you're gonna get run into someone cool or get robbed or someone trying to sell you drugs or whatever but then I went down on John Campbell Road. <laughs> How many goals do you give me to land a kickflip? Three. Three. How many goals, Annie? Maybe two. Okay. No credit. Just